When I tell people how much I like researching burials at a cemetery, uh, the stone carvers, the Victorian headstone symbols, people give me a weird look and, and say weirdly, weirdly they say, okay, we all use symbols each and every day. For instance, we see a red octagon at the corner of the street while we're driving, so we stop. Everything we do through the day, we see and use symbols. When studying headstone symbols, it is important to keep in mind about uh, cemetery symbols that is their meaning. Meaning depends on their time, place, belief system of those using it. Sometimes the meaning of a symbol changes dra uh, dramatically over the centuries. It starts out meaning one thing and it winds up meaning the exact opposite. A good example of this is swastika. Once a symbol of creation for multiple civilizations, now a symbol of hate. So in addition to being aware of symbol context and time and place, you need to understand the belief system behind it. Symbols are so much fun to research and always advise people that it is as that it is. We are going to be talking about these two lions sitting here in front of the uh, W. Schwartz uh, mausoleum. If you ever seen The Wizard of Oz, it probably comes as no surprise that the king of the jungle often represents courage when seen in a graveyard. Lions may also signify God's power and the strength to combat evil. A pair of lions often suggests the wealth and pride in a strong family lineage. Uh, there's also a folklore saying when you have two lions in front of a mausoleum, if someone tries to break in and grave rob the mausoleum, the lions come alive and uh, attack the person doing it to keep them from stealing anything. They are the protectors of the keep. And that's it for lions. Um, they are amazing. We have some here. We have some in Elmwood Cemetery as well. And if you plan on doing any grave robbing, I wouldn't suggest it. These guys will stop you. All right, guys. Have a great day. We'll see you in the next video.